so um, to start what you want to do is make sure you have a nice solid surface that you're able to see your drawing and your object in the same line of view so you can compare and then I normally like to start with a few small compositional sketches side to side where I'm going to put my object so you can come up with all sorts of different compositional um, ideas and you play around until you find one that you enjoy I think we'll just go with a uh, big plan now always assume all that every single one of your marks is going to be subject to revision so nothing I'm drawing extremely light to begin with a lot of people immediately go into detail and go heavy what you want to do is get to proportions so I have a, a line here that marks the length of the handle to the um, silver part to the bristles but there's a relationship between all three of them so you need to make sure that your relationship is correct there's no point doing fancy shading until you've got to correct so the drawing emerges it doesn't start off a lot of people immediately start doing tiny little detail is absolutely pointless. You want to start from general to specifics. And you see I'm jumping all over the drawing because you don't stick to one part. You're always just correcting, changing and editing everything you do. Slowly but surely, a shape emerges, forms emerge. Now, the next thing you're going to do is you're going to briefly just divide your drawing into the light and dark families, just to get an idea of your tones. Again, your shading is not done in one spot. There's no way that you're going to get your tonal control down so well that you can know exactly the tone of a tiny little element without comparing it and contrasting it to everything else. And then you can start cleaning up your your lines with um, with your kneadable eraser you can actually shape it quite nicely uh, and you see for example little areas of turns here on the edge are actually it's perfect just for these tiny little elements So at every point I'm able to correct and improve the drawing because nothing's too heavy, nothing's too committed. Nice and light. Yeah. And that's how you start a drawing.